I can tell you that when I met the SIA pilots, I didn't meet them on TV. I met them face to face, five feet across the table so that they can see me. They can see if I am still vigorous, able to campaign and take them on. Whether it's worth taking me on. And I offered them two choices. Either you stop this intimidation, which is what it was, bringing the SIA right down, disrupting its services, ruining its reputation, millions of dollars of advertisements and sales ruined within a matter of two weeks. I gave them a choice. Continue this and I will by every means at my disposal teach you and get the people of Singapore help me teach you a lesson you won't forget. And I am prepared to start all over again or stop it. Get back to work. Restore discipline and then argue your case. Took them 65 minutes before they decided, okay, it's not worth the fight. Why? Because they know they lose. They know that I'm prepared to ground the airline they know that I can get their line going again without them. Let there be no mistake about it. Whoever governs Singapore must have that iron in them. Or give it up. This is not a game of cards. This is your life and mine. And I spent a whole lifetime building this. And as long as I'm in charge, Nobody's gonna knock it down. Whenever I'm in need of inspiration and on the lookout for lessons on oratory, I revisit this speech by the Lion of Singapore, Lee Kuan Yew. He delivered this speech sometime in the early 80s after his famous showdown with the SIA pilots. Look at the wiry leader's aggressive demeanor, his body language, mannerism, excellent and perfect delivery. The performance is astounding. And if not, consider this as a lesson in public leadership. You got to have iron in you if you got to be in public life.